Our planet is a collection of worlds within worlds. But there's more drama in nature than meets the eye. This is an exploration of one of nature's secret micro-worlds. Here on the edge of New Zealand's South Island, the shores of Dunedin are an iconic wilderness. Yet, there lies a world of animals hidden from view. This is life where land meets ocean. Life that has been shaped by the eternal rise and fall of the tides. Rockpool animals live with one foot in two very different worlds. In this tiny universe, food to eat and a place to live is key to survival. Limpets control the algae by scraping them off the rocks. But when a limpet wanders off to feed, it leaves behind a trail of mucus so it can find its way back to its home scar, its very own home on the rocks. Finding a home in the rock pool is most important. Competition for space is fierce and finding that home could be the difference between life and death. Some creatures blend perfectly into their environment. Others, like this chitin, deal with the struggle for space by making another animal their home. Wherever their home or hide, rock pool animals find their homes transformed twice a day. The high and low tides mean the intertidal zone faces some of the most extreme conditions in nature. Temperatures drop, salinity changes, and the animals must constantly adapt. Fish too have learnt to live out of water. At low tide, some tuck themselves into microhabitats under rocks where there's just enough water to keep them alive until the ocean returns. Different creatures have different ways of dealing with the turning tides. 500 million years ago, mollusks developed an evolutionary marvel, a protected, thermoregulated home. But hard shells are not always protection from predators. There's nothing more sinister in a rock pool than a marauding sea star. Sea stars have evolved sophisticated tube feet to feed even on mollusks. But dangers also come from above. Many seabirds depend on rock pools for survival. Some have larger beaks and have developed fishing techniques to break through hard shells. But there are creatures that outwit the seabirds too. Soft and vulnerable though they look, sea slugs absorb toxins and make themselves a rather unpleasant snack. But the complex defences of this wonderful world cannot stand a chance against this creature. Around the world, intertidal habitats face extreme pressures from human activities threatening the lives of millions of creatures that depend on them. Hidden though they may be from the naked eye, nature's micro-worlds, like rock pools, are complex and dramatic. Secret sanctuaries in Dunedin that are as special as the shores beyond. <laughs>